bom tá aqui com vocês aqui nessa roda com esse conjunto Capoeira is an Afro-Brazilian art form that fuses dance, martial arts, acrobatics, music, movement, tradition, history, culture, with a deep rooted history in the African traditions brought to Brazil by enslaved Africans. Jinga! Capoeira really teaches you that you can overcome challenges regardless. You learn how to control your emotions and how to smile and keep moving. I believe in the power of capoeira to transform lives, to make people stronger, make people better citizens, better athletes, healthier physically and mentally. I'm living as a capoeirista, and in capoeira, my title is formanda, or in our group is a brown belt, and I'm about 21 years into the art form. Being a capoeirista manifests itself in so many different ways. You're a dancer, a singer, you're a martial artist, you kick, you sweep, you sweat, you cry, you laugh, you fight. What is like a strategic game of chess? You play with your body, but you play very much with your mind. Capoeira was forbidden because like many things that came from Africans, it was considered nefarious practice, it was considered dangerous, it was considered what street people and marginalized individuals practice. It wasn't until the 1930s when it slowly became more accepted. It was recognized as a national sport. It was celebrated. And it's beautiful to see how an art that came from Africans forcibly brought to Brazil, practiced all over the world, in after-school programs, in universities, in refugee camps. It's something that's universal, that's global. I learned a lot through my work in Capoeira, and one of the things I learned is that you really are capable of much more than you believe that you're capable of. Capoeira is losing yourself in the moment, giving yourself up to the energy of the hall, the energy of the music, the energy of the song, and letting yourself move organically. It's really empowering. It's the art of liberation, the art of freedom.